G'day, Paul Bird here. Well, today when the winds are blowing, I thought I'd show you something land-based, and it's all about knots and rigs. You can have everything done up properly, but when you get out on the boat, if it's not done right, you can easily lose the fish. All that money and expense spent can be going down the drain. So here's one quick knot that I'm going to show you. Now, if you have your braided line and of course your monofilament leader, how do you join it? Well, it's pretty hard to see in this particular case. So what I'm going to do is use something a little heavier so you can easily see it. And in this case, I'm using some rope. Now this is called the uni knot. Basically, I'm doing a double uni knot here to join it up. Now our braided line is generally thin and of course, our monofilament leader is generally a touch thicker. So what we will do here is lap it over like so, form a loop with your braided line, go around the, the main line through the loop several times and pull it tight like so. We then turn around and we do the monofilament line around the braid, like so. Pull it tight, like so. Now we have this. We pull them both tight, wiggle them together. It's a bit, a bit harder with rope until they form an even knot like that. No need to pull it tight. Don't pull it tight because what we need to do is tighten the knots to start with and that's by pulling the braided line to start with nice and tight we pull the monofilament line nice and tight and you have this little gap here and all we're going to do is slide that together like so the double uni knot one that you should practice and always use if you're out there using braid to monofilament